Will Per Thai make its own coalition and elect its own prime minister, leaving behind the Move Forward Party and Pita Lim Jaron Rat? Well, the Per Thai Party is ready to form an alternative coalition, excluding the Move Forward Party, and it will bring in parties from the outgoing government if MFP leader Pita Lim Jaron Rat fails to secure enough support to become prime minister in parliament on Wednesday. That's today. According to Per Thai sources. Now, the sources said that Mr. Pita, the MFP's sole prime ministerial candidate, faces several hurdles to his PM bid, and he will still not be able to receive sufficient backing during the second round of voting, which takes place today on Wednesday, 19th of July. They said the first hurdle is that his critics, especially the 250 senators, will cite Parliamentary Meeting Regulation Number 41, which prohibits a motion that has been rejected by Parliament from being resubmitted during the same session to block his renomination. If rejected, the PM vote will be rescheduled and Per Thai will have a chance to nominate its own candidate. The sources said adding Sretha Tavisin, one of the party's three PM candidates, is expected to get the nod. The sources went on to say there is not much chance of forming a new coalition government with the MFP because most senators have made it clear they will not support the party due to its stance on amending Section 112 of the Criminal Code or the Les Majiste Law. To overcome this hurdle, Per Thai will take the lead in forming the new government and exclude the MFP while trying to bring some parties from the outgoing government into the coalition, such as the Pum, Pum Jai Thai Party, the Palang Parcharat Party, and the Chat Thai Patana parties with a combined number of 300 or so MPs. This composition is most likely to happen and it must be agreed upon by the parties mentioned above and approved by the senators before the next round of voting if Mr. Pita fails in his bid today. That's according to the sources. That was mm. a direct quote. Pat Tong Tan Shinawatra, one of the Pua Thai's three <coughs> prime minister candidates, said on Tuesday the party will nominate Mr. Sreta for the coveted role of prime minister if the joint parliamentary session rejects the nomination of Mr. Pita on Wednesday. Mm. Is this going to happen? So, mm. early predictions are suggesting that Pita Lim Chetranrat still will not have enough votes mm-hmm. to become prime minister, <clears throat> even if he does uh, basically get to stand for the voting. But, but so, the, the question is, can he make up ground? Like, will he be able to convert some of those um, abstentions from last week? Well, and to That's the thing. Yeah. Most people are saying most probably not. Yeah. And the most likely outcome seems to be mm-hmm. that uh, Per Thai will get a chance and uh, possibly get a chance to elect their own prime minister candidate. Mm-hmm. We're s- it's all speculation for now. We're going to have to wait to see. Today is the 19th of July. Today is the D-Day. Mm-hmm. So more information later today. Stay tuned for that on thetiger.com. 